the sims too with my favorite family the beautiful leva family and yes looks like our girl raquel is back to work after having a baby and she did snap back a pretty pretty nicely yeah so if you guys didn't know she is in the military career track and so um she must head back to her duties i think she's like a junior let's see here She's like a junior recruiter, a junior officer. So she's doing pretty good. I do need to work on a couple of her skills so that she can kind of advance at work. But so far, so great. And so, yeah, so she's back to work again. <clears throat> Excuse me, got a little frog in my throat this morning. I haven't had my cup of coffee yet, so I'll need to get that soon. <laughs> anyway, guys, yeah, so everything's been going pretty good with the fam bam. Um, looks like um, we got your guy over here, Juan. He's doing the gardening, um, which he, you know, he's helping out as much as he can around the house here, um, being as much help because, you know, of course, your guy doesn't have a job. So um, what we're going to be doing today, it's about – well, it's almost, it's like the crack of dawn. It's only like 7 o'clock in the morning. And so the kids are going to be off to uh, school soon. And right now, Dad is actually taking a full responsibility over uh, Junior, Junior Blaze over here. Let me show you what's been going on with Blaze. I'll let you guys know we actually lost Blaze in the house um, upstairs in a corner, in a corner of a room. So I was just kind of freaking out. I don't know what happened to Blaze, but he looks like... 10 times darker than he was before. I don't know what's going on. He actually also looks a little green, and Dad needs to clean up this uh, freaking mess that's been left around um, here. Let's go ahead and have him um, go ahead and clean up and dispose of all this stuff. Go ahead and play with little guy, cuddle him, play with him, and then uh, we're going to send him off to bed. And so hopefully Dad can um, get through his day uh, of being the only one here to take care of Blaze. And so we're going to see how that kind of works out. Um, what are the kids doing? Uh, we, Of course, of course, you know you got your, you got Braylon up here into all kinds of trouble early in the morning playing around. I wonder if he's, if he's even done his homework. Well, guess what, guys? He now is an A-plus student. And um, Raquel was really concerned about your guy here, Braylon, because he, you know, is more or less like, you know, the, the funny guy, the fool around guy. Um, and I think he looks just like his dad, looks just like his dad. And he definitely has his hair. So yeah, so he's been doing good. Um, you have your, the baby girl here, my, uh, the prodigy, the child prodigy, um, definitely not a rambunctious rant like her brother. Let's get a zoom in of this, uh, cute little girl here. She actually, um, has been doing really good in school. She's an A-plus student. And so um, guess what we're going to be doing today? I know I've been dreading it, but I'm going to do it. And you guys are probably wondering what I'm dreading. I am actually going to have the family um, go ahead, and we're going to have Dad Juan bring over. Uh, did he ever pick up the baby? He is such a – he can be such a butthole sometimes. Go ahead and pick him up. Did you play with him? He probably already played with him. We just kind of missed the interactions. Um, yeah, so what we're going to be doing is, um, we are going to be calling over the headmaster. That's what I was dreading. The headmaster. Yes, the headmaster. We're going to call the headmaster over. Oh my gosh, what happened to my baby? He looks, I, you know, no offense, he just looks a little browner than what he was originally actually looking like at first. It was kind of funny. Anyway, yeah, so, um. Yeah, um, I just can't keep my eyes off <laughs> what he turned out to look like. He didn't look like that the other day. I guess they changed. The babies do change. Yeah. I don't know. You might need to get a DNA test for this one. I'm not sure. Anyway, guys, um, yeah, he's a cutie pie. He definitely takes after his mom for sure. Um, yeah, so, um, yeah, I need, I'm going to call the headmaster over gonna call the headmaster over just to get the kids in um, school into private school we've been wanting to do that for a while and it's one of Raquel's wants so we're gonna definitely work on that okay so we're gonna have Juan come and put the baby in the crib put Blaze in the crib mom gets off pretty early see she gets off at one o'clock so she can definitely relieve husband and then um what we can do next after that is we will, um, I'm going to call over the headmaster early. And so I don't know, do you call him over now or do, do you have to call him over later? I don't know. We'll see. Why would you have to do that? Um, let's go downstairs and, um, well, I think I can just kind of click on him. I gotcha. I gotcha. 
what would he be upset about? It's not like he, I don't understand that. All right, entertainment. Well, we can't do any of that. All right, so why would you be upset? Why? Why are you upset? Why? Just why? I don't understand why he would be upset. I mean, they just had a baby, and his aspiration to go ahead and take a bubble bath. Just kind of do that, yeah. Go ahead and take a bubble bath. I don't know. I'm going to look into his aspiration. I don't understand why he'd be upset at all. All right. Juan's lifetime wants is to raise 20 puppies or kittens. I didn't know that. <laughs> I'm like, what is this? All right, didn't know that. Um, what else? What does he want? I don't know. Maybe what we can do is we can... I don't even know how to get over here. Oh, okay. Puny leader. All right, so we need to work on in, his influence. But it looks like he wants to raise kittens. I had no I had no idea that he wanted to do that. That's kind of crazy. Had no idea. Um, so maybe we'll work on that a little bit later. Um, we'll work on maybe, I don't know, maybe we can get the kids a pet. Maybe not this episode, but in future. I don't know. Uh, we'll see. We'll see. Um, I'm really just trying to get the household in some order since we now have uh, baby Blaze over here. Uh, we definitely want to make sure that um, the family is kind of, you know, not so chaotic as they have been. Um, yeah, so what we're going to have him do, look at him, he's like, uh, what are we going to do next? All right, so um, what we've been doing lately is I've been trying to get his, um, he's been doing really good out here in his gardening. Um, <clears throat> so I've been working on that. And um, we need to come out here. Why don't you come out here and tend to Minnie? So he's going to actually do uh, some gardening. He's been actually doing really good with this, and I really like that he's been kind of doing it on his own. So we're going to have him come and do that. And, um, yeah, we're going to have him do that. And then we're going to have him uh, paint custom painting, too. So he needs to actually go ahead and do that. Um, I had actually had wanted him to use some of this custom painting to um, kind of sell or the real life painting, but I find myself, we had a little project where he was actually doing it for fun, actually doing it and actually kind of decorating the house and having some keepsakes with the kids. So um, I actually took some, uh, a portrait of um, their oldest, their, well, well, she is the oldest daughter. I did some portraits of her, so I don't know, maybe we can do portraits of the whole family and then we can start trying to sell other paintings that he that he does so I'm gonna actually have him <laughs> that's cute how cute is that um what are we gonna do now um what I'm gonna do right now is I'm gonna actually have him paint some uh pictures of uh just kind of these kind of images and then then I won't really mind us selling it you know how about we do this? I think this is cool. Do that. That's a nice painting. Nice black and white painting. So he'll be working on that. And your girl, Raquel, she just got home um, from work. And um, I really like her outfit, though. I've been loving this outfit. I love military. I love uniforms. They're so, so nice. Love those uniforms. So she's going to be doing some stuff. She's got to actually work up her skills. She's kind of looking like, okay, she's about to start getting worried about working um, and not kind of fulfilling some of her wants. So we're going to have to work on that for the girl because, you know, hey, that's what we're here for, right? That's how we play the game. All right, so let me click on her. Invite headmaster. So we're going to, um, I know, hold him in a minute. I want us to make sure that we in invite this headmaster over. Let's see. All right, the local private school headmaster is interested in coming over for dinner. Do you feel like entertaining? If so, the, this there might be an admittance to the private school in the works. So, yeah, we're going to invite him over. So he'll be here at 5. I'm already nervous, and it's because I've literally... I've literally, I've literally lost out on, let's pull some of these weeds. Like, you got to let the baby cry it out. He'll be fine. Yeah, I've been literally kind of, like, stressed out about this moment because when I used to play The Sims before, <clears throat> I've had, like, major, major downfalls when I um, brought over the headmaster, like, uh, of course, we did not get in to private school. And so hopefully we can get them into private school. We're going to make sure that this house is all cleaned up and nice. Look at her. She's like, she acts like she's playing a concerto or something like that. You're not Liberace, girl. All right, so let's go and have her um, come over. And hopefully we know how to do a few things because if you don't, like, I think you need to know how to schmooze and everything. If you don't, it's going to be kind of hard to kind of get through this with the headmaster. But anyway, Brody is in a shop class making a small feeder. It's a pretty boring project, and Brody is pretty sure she can, uh, she can, and 
at some elements to make the bird feed her better, but they've been told to strictly follow the direction. Should Brody stick with the boring plans or plan her own exciting bird feeder? I'm going to have it make it exciting. Feed, feeding birds is okay, but by the time Brody is done with hers, it's also it also has a squirrel flinging system and auto portioning. Her, he her teacher is impressed but thinks the squirrel flinging is a bit violent and sends Brody to the guidance counselor who suggests therapy, which ends up costing Brody's family a small amount of Samoans. Alrighty now, okay. Alrighty, I don't think Raquel is going to be too happy about that. Okay, so let's have her clean that up. And um, I don't know. I think I'm going to, well, we, we're going to wait about maybe two about three i think we should start making dinner like right now right now um grill i know i'm gonna have to have everything from coffee and everything i'm gonna have her serve lunch so she only knows how to do a few things and so i'm a little i'm a little nervous that it's going to go kind of bad for us i don't know so i don't know we'll see we'll see uh Oh, oh my god they don't have any more groceries i forgot about that in the sims like they don't have any groceries all right so let's get on the phone i know i've left many phones around here so let's get on the phone and um call oh my god this is gonna put a wrench in my plans all right so we're gonna call for groceries over here or i think she could have done them online so she needs to get off of there it's already three o'clock and I'm already nervous about this, so yeah. Let's go and have her recycle some of the stuff over here. Yeah, Brody, we're already putting you to we're already putting you to work already. Go ahead and recycle groceries. Okay. What will we order? And why does it still show them at school? Okay. Food costs. Alright, we need to I don't know, eight hundred dollars? Well we got twelve yeah, we need we need everything. Yeah. Thank you for your order. Uh, we'll be by shortly with your items. Are you kidding? Oh, snaps. We are in trouble. Like, the headmaster's supposed to be over in an hour, and we don't have anything. Uh, no, they are not. I don't know what is up with adults calling kids. That's so crazy. So, yeah, so the headmaster's going to be over in a little while. I'm going to go ahead and have um, no drink coffee. Well, I guess we already have coffee made. Hopefully it tastes good. Hopefully that works good. So, yeah. So, um, oh, so he's here, finally. All right, cool. Cool beans. Let's look around the house, make sure that everything's in place, because the headmaster will be over in an hour. And um, so, yeah. So, yeah. What I'm going to do also, too, um, is I'm going to make sure that um, I believe this is going to work. This is no cheat. I mean, I'm not cheating. I'm going to actually make sure that their free will is off. I don't want them messing up nothing. So, yeah. Um, let's see. So, yeah. So, the food. Oh, no, 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 no. Yeah, get the food. Get the food. Get the food. The little girl. Did she get the food? Okay. I think she got the food. Cool. Cool beans. All right. So, we're going to now go ahead and... Um, Oh my god, is okay, I, I was about to freak out. I thought that was a headmaster. But see how the time goes? Like it's already like 4.30. Alright, so let's have mom serve dinner. Um, and she's gonna make spaghetti tonight. So go ahead and start on the spaghetti. Um, and then um Brody and the kids, just have them sit right here, sit right here, sit here. And um, dad is, I think he's still working on that painting outside. Yeah, so he's still working on his painting. But doing pretty good with it. He's not doing bad. Um, the headmaster, no, I was already getting nervous. The headmaster's not here yet. Um, yeah, and um, all right. Oh, yeah, so, so, they're, so they're both sitting here right now. So we're going to just kind of kind of play it cool, kind of play it cool. I'm going to have dad go and check on baby. He's going to handle all that with the baby, so. And I think the headmaster's kind of coming up. All right. So cuddle Blaze, uh, play with Babe, and change his diaper. All right. So he's here and uh, wish us good luck. Um, oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. All righty. So, um, oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Is she still cooking? She's still cooking. She's still cooking. And um, all right. We're going to have to let that baby cry for a second. All right. So, all right. Greet, uh, greet him. So we need to greet him real quick. Hurry up and greet him. Hurry, hurry, hurry. All right, so we've greeted him. Um, 
Let's see. Go ahead and smooth them a little bit. Uh, talk, mm. chat, and hopefully we work this out pretty well. Um, yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All right. Um, uh, schmooze about school. All right, so we need to get some schmooze points here. Need to get those. Uh, she's actually served dinner, and so Raquel will come out and schmooze and about school. And um, so, yeah. No, you're not sitting down. You must let him sit down, too. All right, so he's going to go upstairs because we got a major thing that's going on. We need to make sure that the baby is being taken care of, right? Because she's, like, she's, like, screaming his head off. So let's um, come over here, hold Blaze. And, um, yeah, so he needs to handle that with Blaze. He needs to handle that with Blaze. And, um, yeah. All right. All right. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. Oh, my gosh. She looks like, he looks like he's already ready to leave about school. All right, so she's going to schmooze him some more. We need 90 points. We need 90 points for schmoozing. And then um, we can talk to him, chat, and um, entertain, um, give tour. All right, so a uh, tour of your home would be nice. So we're about to give the tour of the house. So she's smoothing him a little bit to get some more schmoozing points there. Um, yeah, so... And we only got four, oh, I think we got like four hours left, so that's good. And what's dad doing with the baby? Did he feed him? Uh, change diaper. All right. You guys, we are trying to work this out. All right, so why isn't she giving a tour? Go on and give him a tour for we miss out on points. So she's going to actually give him a tour of the house. Um, all right, let me bring the walls down. Um, bring him in this room first. Go here. All right, so he should follow us, I believe. All right, so he's going to follow us in here. And, um, yeah, so when we when he follows us, I think that he'll he'll be able to see around the room and he'll be able to kind of see what we got, what we're working with here. So go here. All right, take him in here. Yeah. And so he should come in here as well to look around. I don't think that we do anything else but just kind of take him on a tour of the house right and then um go here um so take him in here and um yeah i don't know i hope this works i don't even see any points for the tour yet all righty so we've brought him in here and then um let's see let him look around and then um i don't know i don't know if we need to do anything else but that so we're gonna Go ahead and uh, show room. Oh, my gosh. I was supposed to tell him to show room. I forgot. All right, so we're going to show the room. All right. Oh, my gosh. This is not working. Show room. Oh, okay. I've already seen it. All right. Did we show him this room? Did we show him this room? Go here. And then um, show room. Did you see this room already? All right, so 15 tour points, that's it. All right, so let's go and let me see. Let me call him uh, Schmuse. Okay, in tour. All right, so now I think we need to go ahead and um, ask him to eat dinner. Um, schmooze a little bit about school and... Um, we only got nine schmooze points, and we need 90. Like, we're not doing well with that at all. Talk, chat. Um, all right. Oh, shoot. All right. Um, the headmaster's stomach is round. Okay. All right. So, talk. Um, I don't know. Why is it not asking me to give him entertain? Call for dinner. All right. So, we're going to call him for dinner. So, yeah. So, um, let's go ahead and let's all of us eat, rather. All right. So, let's. All right. So, he can eat dinner now. Go ahead and eat. Why is he not eating dinner? No, 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 no. All right, what is going on here? What is going on? This is what I'm telling you guys. Like, I never seem to do this right. I don't want to smooth about school. Is he going to eat dinner? All right. All righty, so he's going to sit down to eat dinner. Hopefully he likes dinner. If he likes dinner, then we'll... I heard that you're supposed to let him eat dinner alone. But the way that our points are looking, they're not looking very good. So I don't know. Maybe we need to have... Put down the baby and then let's have Juan um, come and eat dinner with him. Eat. 
I heard, well, no, we don't want to eat dinner with him. We definitely don't want to do that. Um, let's see. Go ahead and eat, and then we're going to have the kids just eat dinner. <laughs> he didn't even get any dinner, I don't think. Yeah, so, and then we just need to make sure that coffee is here so he can have coffee after dinner, I believe. And um, I don't know. I don't know. It's not going very well. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see because we need we need more points than what we have, and we're not having them right now, so I don't know. But I wanted him to eat his the dinner alone. Let me go back over to the headmaster. Okay, so he's eating dinner. All right, so what should Raquel do next? Talk, um, chat, and then we can go ahead and schmooze again and then talk about work, all right? And then we'll have um, Juan uh, talk and chat. So let's see how this works. Let's see how that works out with him. All right, um, we didn't even get any food points yet. Oh, man. All right, let me see what happens next. 32 food, food points. I don't see how we're going to get anything else out of this guy. Let's do some more smoozing. The smoozing went bad. Like, I don't think the kids are going to get in at this point. I don't think they're going to get in. Let me. All right, go ahead and smooth them too. Uh, talk and then chat. And then schmooze. Like, we just need to schmooze him to death because that's not work. Well, he can't schmooze about work because he's not even doing well at work. So we won't do that. Um, I think we would should also ask for, like, a cup of coffee, but I'm not seeing the interaction to do so. Oh, my God. Yeah, you're, you're ruining things. All right, so we don't want him to talk to him anymore. Let's go ahead and have her talk to him, schmooze, and about school. And hopefully we get more points because we don't have a lot of points at all. Um... see you talk all right go to the restroom man like he's like ruining it anyway use all right go on go on um i don't know drink coffee like do we offer him coffee oh my gosh i can't remember drink coffee i don't know if she offers or what but everything is spoiling guys and he's looking like the headmaster i don't think is going to give us any more points and i think i've lost this challenge uh, yet again yet again yeah, I think we lost it again. And I can't remember, like, do we juggle mugs? Look at the dad. Like, he's like, we've totally, like, lost this challenge. Look at him. He's, like, passed out. We have totally lost this challenge. Like, this is the end of us with this challenge. It's got, like, 14 seconds left. Dad is passed out. Mom is, like, freaking sitting and having a cup of coffee. And uh, so, yeah. Yeah, once again, we have lost this challenge. Um, like I said, I have yet to become, look at the headmaster. He's like, you guys suck. Like this, it's no way I would give you. <laughs> oh my gosh. I have to take a picture of that. We lost it again. I don't know what we did. I don't know. I don't know. But we're going to have to go and just, just go ahead and start cleaning up. We're going to just start cleaning up. Let me pull the walls down. Yeah, we're going to, we're going to just, we're going to take our. We're going to just kind of take our humble pie and go on about our way because it's not going to work. I got to, I don't know what I did wrong. And I think that's the total score. I don't even know if there'll be a final score. Um, yeah, but Raquel needs to clean that mess up. And I can't remember. I, I know that you're supposed to offer him a cup of coffee, but I can't remember how to do that. Um, clean up. Go ahead and clean that up. And, um, yeah, so we lost that challenge. Um, is the headmaster even here anymore? Did he leave? Um, look at him. And we're not even paying attention to him anymore because we already know we failed. We sucked. Uh, the headmaster does not think that this is the kind of family that should be associated with such a fine institution. Ah, oh, screw you. Anyway, guys, we lost the challenge. No, no, no. We are not going to private school yet. I don't know. Maybe um, if I look at it, maybe we need to get their schmoozing up a little bit. Um, I'm going to take the kids off of free will so they can do whatever they frick they want to. Um, so, yeah. We lost the challenge. Look at all the flies and all of the mess that's going on in the household. <laughs> oh, my God. This family is so funny. Clean up. Um, yeah, we lost the challenge. Dad is passed out on the floor. The kids' are fun is down, and we are just kind of just going through a mess of things around the house. I don't know. I don't know which one we did worse at. Um, yeah. 
I don't know. Maybe next time. Maybe next time. All right. So I think I'm going to go ahead and call it quits for now, guys. I hope you enjoyed the disastrous headmaster plan and uh, the hope and attempt to get the kids into private school was an epic fail. Um, but in the end, we still have the Leva of love and we love each other. And that's all that matters, right? No, we really want to get the kids in private school. So hopefully um, we can do it. We can finally get these kids into private school because that is an aspiration of um, your girl here, R Raquel. So we're going to make that happen. I promised her that and we're going to make it happen. All right, guys, anyway, enough of the funny stuff. I hope you enjoyed my gameplay. And if you did, why don't you like, comment, and subscribe? And I will see you all in the next part. See you, bye. See you and bye for now. <laughs> bye, guys.